micro, small and medium enterprises, jointly called MSMEs, play a major role in the Indian economy. However, the sector is one of the major consumers of energy. It consumed an estimated 50.5 million tons of oil equivalent in 2012, which is growing at about 6% annually. It is estimated that 15 to 20% of energy consumed by the sector could be saved with proper planning. To help MSMEs achieve this goal, the Bureau of Energy Efficiency, along with Ministry of MSME and Cluster Level Associations, initiated a project titled National Programme on Energy Efficiency and Technology Upgradation in SMEs. The Pali Textile Cluster is one of the biggest SME clusters in India, having over 250 member industries. The units are classified into two segments mainly, hand process units and power process units. The BEE SME project aimed to initially implement energy efficient technologies in selected units in the cluster. These units will act as demonstration units for long term and sustainable penetration of energy efficient technologies in the entire cluster. Inspire Network for Environment was selected as the implementing agency for the program. A significant portion of steam gets converted into water droplets due to condensation in machine operations. When steam condenses, the temperature remains the same. This condensate, also called saturated water, gets drained out in the conventional process. To recover heat loss through condensate, condensate recovery system has been introduced. This recovers the saturated water and the sensible heat contained in the discharged condensate making considerable energy savings. Loss of steam from the process can be avoided by installation of float or steam traps. This enables filtering of the condensate from the steam and passing it back to the boiler feed water. The condensate free steam thus passes through the system and is completely utilized. benefits <laughs> For example, when we have implemented it, we have used 40% of the steam boiler in the feed water. It has been reduced by 10 to 15% of the fuel quantity consumed. For generating steam for the process, a water tube boiler is used, which is heated by suitable fuel such as pet coke, wood, biomass, etc. The total annual energy saving is 25 to 40 tons of oil equivalent in a typical textile unit or about 10 to 15 percent of conventional system. Results of this technologies we will uh, share through outreach and awareness program in other clusters. For this purpose we will organize uh, workshops and seminars in other clusters to uh, adopt similar technologies by them. The energy efficient interventions in the Pali textile cluster have been successfully demonstrated in five textile processing units. Most of the units in this cluster and adjoining areas are still using the conventional processes. If implemented in 400 units, the interventions can lead to energy savings of 12,000 tons of oil equivalent and reduction of 16,000 tons of carbon dioxide per year. I want to urge all the MSMEs in the country to adopt new and energy efficient technologies so that their processes become economically viable, beneficial and at the same time the country will have a lot of energy savings and in turn will lead to a lot of reduction in the carbon dioxide.